It's Monday, December 30th here in Seoul, and this is your daily news from Korea Now. I'm Mihae Chung. South Korean pitcher Ryu Hyunjin will now don number 99 for the Toronto Blue Jays, which signed him to a four year, 80 million US dollar contract. Ryu has had that number throughout his pro career, which began in South Korea in 2006 and shifted to the majors with the Los Angeles Dodgers in 2013. 99 is a sacred number in Canadian sports, for it was worn by one of the country's greatest athletes, the hockey legend Wayne Gretzky. Thus, the number brings greater burden to whoever decides to put it on. But Ryu's agent Scott Boras said with a smile, Canada lent number 99 to LA and so with Hyunjin, we thought we'd return it back to Canada, referring to the stunning trade that sent Gretzky from the Edmonton Oilers to the Los Angeles Kings in 1988. He also added that the Blue Jays understood what value you could bring to their progressive franchise, expecting the synergy with their young players. North Korea discussed offensive measures to ensure the country's sovereignty and security during the second day session of a major party meeting, state media reported Monday. According to the Korean Central News Agency, Kim presided over the second day session Sunday of the fifth plenary meeting of the 7th Central Committee of the Workers' Party of Korea. Emphasizing the need to take positive and offensive measures for fully ensuring the sovereignty and security of the country as required by the present situation, he indicated the duties of the fields of foreign affairs, munitions industry, and the armed forces of the DPRK, the KCNA said in English. The meeting came as North Korea has threatened to take a new way with regard to denuclearization talks with the United States if Washington fails to show flexibility before the end of this year, hinting that it would end diplomacy and return to provocative acts. The US has warned Pyongyang against provocations, saying it could lose everything, while North Korea has said it has no more to lose. BTS Jungkook has been named the winner of the Most Handsome Faces of 2019. TC Candler revealed this year's 100 Most Handsome Faces last Friday, and Jungkook took the number one spot for 2019. The world-famous 100 Most Handsome Faces and 100 Most Beautiful Faces have been published annually by TC Candler and independent critics since 1990. Among over 120,000 candidates, TC Candler and independent critics evaluate based on the number of votes on social media, along with the opinion of 500 experts to select the final 100 names to the list. Following BTS's V, who took the title back in 2017, Jungkook is the second member to win the title. He was followed by CEO PewDiePie at number 2 and Shawn Mendes at number 3. V came in as number 4 and Jimin and Chin also ranked at number 19 and number 44. Meanwhile, BTS is slated to feature in the New Year's Eve special show, Dick Clark's New Year's Rockin' Eve on December 31st. And those are your top headlines for today. For full-length articles, you can always check out our official website linked down below. And don't forget to subscribe to Korea Now for your daily news feed.